guys, всем привет! Welcome to my channel. Milo says hi. He's like snoring so much. Yeah, I know. Today I want to show you how to make this delicious raspberry waffle cake. It's so so good, so yummy, and it's very very easy to make. I like to decorate it in this cute style, and if you have spare waffles, which you can get in Eastern European stores, then you can definitely make this cake. Now let's get started. In a large bowl add your softened butter and you want to mix it with your blender and this process will take about five minutes you really want to mix the butter until it becomes white and pale so then we're gonna add icing sugar and whisk everything together one more time and this will soften the butter and also make it very very sweet and delicious once you get the beautiful butter consistency, you can add your raspberry jam and you can control how much jam you want to add. I'm adding about two large tablespoons for this recipe and mixing everything together. Once you have the consistency, you want to spread your buttercream onto each waffle and gently go around all the edges to make sure that the cake is nice and well spread. Because waffles tend to be quite dry, you do want to add quite a lot of buttercream around the cake. And then you want to just stack up the cake layers on top. And like I said, I got these waffles from Eastern European stores, so make sure you can find something like this. Um, and if you can't, you can also use this recipe just for the normal sponge cakes. Then I'm adding some raspberry jam layer and kind of repeating the process. I'm going to add my buttercream and raspberry and kind of alternate between the two because I do want a good balance of your jam and buttercream together guys and girls I have my recipe on my website at aliceyummyfood.com you'll find full ingredients and also directions on how to make this and also you'll be able to find loads of other recipes that I do for my channel uh, just click through click on the picture and you'll be able to see the whole video with the directions and the full recipe in English and Russian languages You want to repeat the process and carry on with your cake, layering it with jam and buttercream as you go. And it looks so beautiful already, I can't wait to eat it. <laughs> So now we are adding our final layer of buttercream and I'm spreading it around and I left a bit more so I can go around the sides as well and I do want to cover the entire cake just to give it like a much sort of cuter look and it's such a light pink color I really love it uh, of course you can make it more pink if you wanted to um, but yeah so just go around the edges make sure it's nice and smooth once it's done, I'm adding some whipped cream and I've added some pink food coloring into my cream and decided to do these beautiful roses around the edges and also I'm using my Russian piping tips with the normal cream and decorating my cake. But of course, feel free to decorate as you like. I love to have fresh berries in each of my cakes. So I'm adding raspberries and some sprinkles and also some delicious uh, fresh mint and finally I'm decorating it with some dried freeze raspberries around the edges just to give it something extra but yeah guys there it is it's beautiful it's so colorful it's stunning I really love how it looks and of course how it tastes and once the cake had some time to sit and chill so best if you leave it in a room temperature for six hours it's gonna slice into your waffles really really easily and this is how it looks the cake is very creamy very crunchy at the same time all the layers work so well together it's a beautiful combination of raspberry cream and waffles and I think it's such an easy cake you don't have to bake it you can whip this up pretty quickly and enjoy it thank you so much for watching guys